are back here on Girl Talk and Allison Fargione joins us Hello. from Al Harry Furniture Design. It's been so long, we've missed having you on the show. And I'm I sure know, Debbie's yeah. gonna be upset that she missed this. I, know, I think she would like this one, right? Are you like, kidding? Yeah. This is great stuff. Tell us this new inspiration. We've got these beautiful tin panels and you're oh, a new yeah. series and how you're using them. This at uh, Market, I saw this guy who had all these old tins and they come in all different sizes and shapes. And the colors, are, some of them is the original paint from the tins that were in the brownstones on the ceilings and stuff like that okay. in New York and New Jersey. So when I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, that's a door panel. So I designed the whole series, kind of making it look like a little cottage type of feel, really simple, clean lines. And the feature, the focal point will be the tin panel. So they I did a little excellent. sketch. I think Gorgeous. that's the first thing that we'll show. I did a little rough sketch and then handed that to the carpenter, and then he, you know, tweaked it, whatever, and the one that we show has a blue tin panel on it, and so we just, that's like the focal point is the, the tin, and so if you want like a pop of color in your room, but just a little, just to, you know, it just These draws photos your are attention. gorgeous. Yeah, the photos are absolutely gorgeous. Not to mention the texture. Isn't this beautiful? Yeah. I mean, look at the colors. These are just all the end colors to just give a little pop a... in a room with all the neutrals. Yeah, and if the color isn't right, I can always adjust it, you know, mm -hmm. if you have to have it dead on. But they offer a variety of colors, which is really neat. So are you just painting it, or are you using some sort of stain on the top? Well, the way I envisioned it was I wanted the... Again, the focal point to be the tin panel, so the paint finish is going to be very simple. Like the one on, I, on the door, yeah. The part. The yeah. one that I featured, the first one, the little nightstands, the lily nightstands. I just did a really nice, crisp, clean white, real soft glazing, like almost not even noticeable, but right. it's there with Boy, a pretty crystal knob. Isn't it beautiful? Oh my group? gosh, mm -hmm. against that, what you've done, the simplicity yeah. of yeah. The, the exterior of the, the cabinet, of right. the nightstand. And the, the, also, the big thing for me is function, and it's got to have storage. I'm mm -hmm. like a storage nut. So it's got a really nice self closing drawer, a nice shelf inside, um, really pretty crystal knob. And that also could adjust according to the piece. You know, right. like the next so, one. It, like, are you doing buffets? And yeah, the next one I have that we're going to show, which is this door panel that Debbie has. Um, and I think you have the colors. So this one is going to have a layered finish. And I'll start off with the gold, layer the dark. So, and then this will be like the highlight. So your eye will see dark and light with a little bit of this popping right. through. Oh. And so this one I kind of envisioned maybe a metal knob to pick up on the, okay. the background. And again, it has three drawers, three drawers, and a really nice shelf underneath. So, I mean, it's, it's I, they're made so nicely, too. I mean, he did such a good job on these. And you said, you know, like you said, some of these colors are original, but then you can also do some, yeah, I can some adjusting things yeah. to them as well. And, you know, like, again, the thing that's so cool is that each door could be a little different, but again, the color is the same, which makes it kind of interesting. You know? I mean, you as a, a local realtor, when, right. and, and also Beth has the, the interior design experience, right. and you do a lot with your clients to help them freshen up their space or right. help them envision. And right. this would be great for any clients, that great. any buyers that mm -hmm. might say, well, I don't know what to put in this place in the house. And, yeah. and then maybe it is a, like a custom piece that just has a oh, little yeah. bit of Just has a pop and, to yeah. the room, so you get some of the, a lot of the places down here are rentals, or yeah. rental units. So then you just, you know, something like this just really makes it more upscale. Well, and if people are afraid of color, which I find a lot, you know, it kind mm -hmm. of, it's overwhelming. This is just enough where if you do everything nice and clean, either creams or whites, and this just brings in a little color you know, throw on some pillows, and to me, that's you know, really it makes an impact. Makes right? It does. It makes an impact in a special place. So are you taking then pieces that already exist and taking the doors off and adding this component to it? Um, it's something I could do, but I'm having these. I designed some of these, are these and had these made. Specific designs. Right. Yeah, okay. for their cottage series. So if right. you're yeah. interested, ask Allison about the cottage series. And again, if you have a piece that you want to have dressed up, or maybe right. incorporate yeah. this into an existing piece. This gal works wonders, so you are so, so talented. I think they were fun. I liked them. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah. Allison, Love thank it. you as You're always. Al Harry Furniture Design. Stay with us. More to come here on Girl Talk. <laughs>